The commission is yours. The board of directors of the Security Bank of Manhattan has chosen you as the architect for our new building. My congratulations, Mr. Rourke. You've done a beautiful job. The board is quite impressed by the project you submitted. It's a tremendous assignment, an unusual opportunity for an architect. You're unknown, but you'll be famous when this building is erected. It's the chance you've wanted for years, isn't it? Yes. It's yours. On one minor condition. Oh, it's just a small compromise. And when you agree to it, we can sign the contract. Well, what is it? Well, of course, we wouldn't alter your plans in any way. It's the brilliant ingenuity of your plans that sold us on the building. But its appearance is not of any known style. The public wouldn't like it. It would shock people. It's too different, too original. Originality is fine, but why go to extremes? There's always a middle course. So we want to preserve your beautiful design, but just soften it a little with a touch of classical dignity. Here. We've had this made to show you our general idea. It's very simple. All you have to do is copy it. We want you to adapt your building like this. Now there's a touch of the new and a touch of the old. So it's sure to please everybody. The middle of the road. Why take chances when you can stay in the middle? You see, it doesn't spoil anything, does it? And we must always compromise with the general taste, Mr. Roth. You understand that, I'm sure. No. If you want my work, you must take it as it is or not at all. But why? A building has integrity, just like a man, and just as seldom. It must be true to its own idea, have its own form, and, and serve its own purpose. But we can't depart from the popular forms of architecture. Why not? Because everybody's accepted them. I haven't. You wish to defy our common standards? I set my own standard. Well, you intend to fight against the whole world? If necessary. But after all, we are your clients, and it's your job to serve us. I don't build in order to have clients. I have clients in order to build. Mr. Rourke, we can't argue about this. The decision of our board was final. We want these changes. Will you accept the commission on our terms or not? You realize, of course, your whole future is at stake. This may be your last chance. Well? Yes or no, Mr. Rourke? No. You realize what you're doing? Quite. Rourke, this is sheer insanity. Can't you give in just once? After all, you have to live. Not that way. How else? Don't you have to work? I'd rather work as a day laborer, if necessary. Well, can you beat that? No. It was you who recommended this Rourke in the first place. You chose him. You said he would be good. Wasn't he? You suggested those changes. You said he'd accept them. Oh, yes, so I did. Of course, as I told you, Mr. Gail Wynant wants buildings that show a classical influence. Then why did you pick this man? An experiment, gentlemen. A very interesting experiment. But what are we going to do? Pick another architect, of course. Yes, Mr. Toy. 